the inappropriate criticisms by Ukrainians towards the AMX 10 RCR, which is not the standard AMX 10 RC, a French reconnaissance vehicle, in the context of the Russo Ukrainian conflict, are unwarranted and unjustified. It is crucial to understand the role and specific capabilities of this armored vehicle before making misguided judgments. The AMX 10 RCR is fitted with new add on armor composed of steel plates, which provide additional protection against small arms fire and anti tank ammunition. The AMX 10 RC is designed by France for reconnaissance, surveillance, and fire support missions to aid infantry troops. Its high speed makes it a valuable asset on the battlefield, enabling rapid movement to gather vital information. It is equipped with a 105mm cannon, providing considerable firepower for a reconnaissance vehicle. This feature allows it to engage targets located over 2 km away. However, it is important to emphasize that the AMX-10 RCR is not designed to compete with heavy Russian main battle tanks such as the T-90M, which boasts a 125mm cannon. Its firepower is thus lower, but this does not constitute a weakness within the context of its specific missions. It is also worth mentioning that the AMX-10 RCR has not been exposed to high-intensity conflicts like the ongoing one in Ukraine. It has primarily been deployed in Mali and Afghanistan, where it has proven itself in engagements against insurgent armed groups. Therefore, it is unfair to judge it in terms of performance in the context of a large-scale modern war. Nevertheless, France has made improvements to the AMX-10 RCR sent to Ukraine to enhance their performance. While these modifications have not been officially detailed, military analysts believe they include better optical systems for targeting Russian armor, both day and night, as well as an increased range for the 105mm cannon. However, it is important to note that the armor has not been reinforced to preserve the vehicle's mobility. It is true that the lower part of the AMX-10 RC only has an armor thickness of only 10 mm of armor, but the AMX-10 RCR donated to the Ukrainian army is fitted with new add-on armor composed of steel plates, which provide additional protection against small arms fire and anti-tank ammunition. This can pose a problem during the vehicle's advance on the front line, due to the numerous anti-tank and anti-personnel explosive devices deployed by the Russian military in Ukraine. However, it is important to emphasize that these devices pose a threat to most light-armored vehicles, and do not represent a specific weakness of the AMX-10 RCR. The AMX-10 RCR is an outstanding reconnaissance vehicle designed by the French to fulfill specific missions on the battlefield. Its high speed and 105mm cannon allow it to carry out reconnaissance, surveillance, and fire support tasks with considerable firepower. While it may not compete with heavy tanks in terms of firepower or armor, it is essential to judge it based on its intended role and performance in appropriate conflict situations. Ultimately, it is important to recognize that each military vehicle is designed for specific missions, and the AMX-10 RCR excels in its role as a reconnaissance vehicle. In the context of the Russo-Ukrainian conflict, its deployment with specific enhancements demonstrates France's commitment to supporting its allies. However, it is crucial not to judge it based on the expected performance of a heavy main battle tank.